as you can see here, I'm playing the D E S M U M E X86 emulator New Super Mario Bros. But I've been uh, in a comment recently on my last video. I've been asked a question on how to do uh, how to download the DS emulator. So I'm making that video, and I'll message that person later. And I'll put the links in the description as usual. Here we go to download this. I'm just going to move it away. All right. Let me just. And since I've had a, I've seen online there's a lot of people that have trouble getting Dolphin emulator and Super Smash Bros. Melee. Soon I'll make a two-part video of that since that is really a hard task. So what you want to do here is first get Google Chrome link in description to get it. Description is below. And because for me you have to uh, my videos on how to get download stuff I will be using Windows 7 and Google Chrome so if you want to follow up with my videos please get those I think this should work with all Windows I'm not sure about Windows 8 but uh, just get Google Chrome it's free easy to use really worth it and it's trustworthy since it's Google now I'm going to click Nintendo DS on CoolROM.com which is link in the description an awesome emulator and ROM website. I'm on emulators. You want to click emulators. Scroll down and click Nintendo DS. And by the way, Dolphin the emulator. I'll make a video of later. It's GameCube and Wii. D E S M U M E. You want to click that. And now it'll bring you to this screen. You scroll down below whatever ad is there. And ROMs are there. Download now. <coughs> ah. It's pretty much, I think it's the same as, um, Visual Boy, if I'm not mistaken. See? D-E-S-M-U-M-E. -E. There it is. Since it's Google Chrome in the bottom left, you have to watch it download. When it's done, click on it. It'll bring you here. And then what you want to do is click... Oh! You also have to download WinRAR for this. Link in the description. Well, it'll help. When RAR is also trustworthy. Documents and free. It'll say 40 day trial, but it lasts forever. Even though it's off their website. And they actually said. So, you get a type in right up there where you want to save it. Like, you extracted it. You click extract to. And up there you want to. Type your saving destination. I am uploading it to documents. So then you click OK. So then it's going to extract. And then once it's done, what you want to do, go to your documents. And see all these files? What you want to do is make a folder named D-E-S M-U-M-E like that and then you drag all those new files you just got down here into there and there you go you have the DS emulator but first we must test it out Check which one works for you, dev or x86. Different computers play different ones. You'll know it doesn't work when it does this. I'm going to double click it, and it'll show up that black screen, meaning back out, it doesn't work. Now click x86, and for me that's one what works, so then it'll show up no black screen background open ROM then you find your ROM but we don't have a ROM so now you know that works but you need a ROM don't you so you're going to go down to emulators or ROM files this time Nintendo DS 
I'm going to already plan this out. And what I'm going to do is get... Oh, hold on, let me click this. I'm obviously going... Well, not obvious, but... I'm just going to try to find Mario and Luigi. Oh, there it is. Bowser's Inside Story. I oh, always like this game. Scroll down like you did in the past. Download now. Wait for the download your file link. Download your file. Here we are in the bottom left. You're seeing the file being downloaded. Just wait until zero seconds left and it's done. This will take a minute for me. And it'll work like this. It should work this way on every one what emulator you get now this is when WinRAR comes into play when this is done here because what we're wanting to do is extract it again which is really easy to extract RAR folders like this and different folders well it's just easy to extract with WinRAR and it's really helpful so just get it It's done, so going to click it, and just like before, extract two. Documents. I'm doing this one-handed since my camera is in my other hand, so this is kind of hard. Using this type of mouse. Alright, it's done extracting, so I'm just going to back out of the internet, I'm just so I can show you this. Oh god, sorry, wrong thing. That's my old DS emulator that I downloaded earlier. I, I just downloaded the new one just for you guys. Then what you want to do is, since mine's Bowser's Inside Story, I'm making a folder, and mine's going to be named Mario and new eg bowser's inside story drag it uh, drag those two files into mario luigi's now drag that into des mume double click it turn on ah new then you make a folder called rom if there's not already one and drag your ROM, which is the game, into there. Now, you back out, just turn on your DES file in the top left, open ROM. Find where you saved your ROM. I saved mine here. Going to click it. Now, here I go. Just turn it on. There we go. You, that's a successful emulator video, and I will start uh, some walkthroughs on some emulator games I have right now. I'll start them soon, and they will be much better quality. Just see you later. I think. Yep, that's it. So that's how you want to get emulator and ROM for the DES, M-U-M-E, DS emulator. See you and good.